is held completely under the chin. I don't use my hands to support it at all. It's sort of a matter of balance more than pressure. I'm not pressing down real hard. It's sort of balance there. Different violinists will use different things to help them with that. This is called your chin rest and you may want to experiment on a different kind of chin rest. Uh, I actually have some that meet in the middle, some that expand to make them a little taller if your neck's a little taller. Some people like me just use a short a, a sponge on the bottom. Other people will use a shoulder rest and that's better for most people. It's, it's uh, an attachment that fits on the back. I'll show you that when I demonstrate the viola. So here I am in rest position with the violin under my right arm. I have the left arm hand on the bout, or I would call it the shoulder of the violin. And I'm going to go up like this. This is called Statue of Liberty. I'm going to turn the bottom up. See this thing here? I call that the button. Button. Turn the button up to the sky. Put the violin on my shoulder, nestle in, and I hold it. Look, mom, no hands. <laughs>